So remember, in order to access the essential graphics, you do need the Adobe 2017 suite. So once you're inside the After Effects Disruption Suite, go up top to Window. And if you go down below, you will see the Essential Graphics selection. Make sure you check that on. So that's going to call up your Disruption panel. So scroll down and hit the Export Motion Graphics template. So it's going to take a couple minutes in order to export all the content for your Premiere panel. So you can export this into the default essential graphics or export it to a local drive. Hit the OK button. And once the export is done, open up Premiere. And when you're in Premiere, go up top to Window, select the essential graphics. That will call up your essential graphics panel inside Adobe Premiere. And you should see right inside the disruption VFX suite control panel. Now you're going to want to set up a sequence for this. And I'm going to choose a 1080p project. So once I have my sequence set up, I can just drag and drop the disruption VFX suite control panel into the Premiere timeline. And now you should see the disruption control panel inside Adobe Premiere.